at 6. This is KEYT News Channel 3, where the news comes first. Good evening, everyone. Thanks for joining us. I'm Beth Farnsworth. And I'm CJ Ward. The family of a 22-year-old Oxnard man who may have drowned at Kachuma Lake is determined to find him. Isaiah Sanchez was last seen alive Friday night while trying to swim to shore. News Channel 3 reporter Sanchez met up with the grieving family who is spending hours searching the water on boat and by foot. Tori? Beth and CJ, this is a difficult time for dozens of family members who have traveled to Lake Achuma. They tell me they are thankful to everyone who is helping look for their loved one, and they hope they'll find him soon. We're just staying together, you know, that's what, that's what we have to do. Santana Sanchez and more than 50 of her family members are coming together to search for Isaiah. He moved to Oxnard a year ago from the Imperial Valley and was visiting Kachuma Lake with his girlfriend's family. He was on a boat with her brother and uncle when the battery died. He figured it'd be easy to get to shore, swim to shore, and when he realized he couldn't, he tried turning around, going back towards the boat, and he didn't make it. He didn't. He was drifting away instead of going towards the boat. Joaquin Rodriguez is the boyfriend of Isaiah's mother and was there when she got the phone call. Hysterical. Um, no, I, no words can explain. No words can explain. Tuesday morning, a sheriff's helicopter scoured the shores and hidden areas of the lake, looking for any sign of the 22-year-old. The weather conditions continue to play a big factor in this search. The wind has kicked up, causing waves on the water, making it difficult for both boats and kayaks to continue to look for Sanchez. As park rangers, sheriff's deputies, and even lake visitors look for their loved one, the family says that the support is helping them get through this difficult time. I want the community to know that we are thankful for all their help and support that we've been receiving and that all we ask for is just that it continues and just know that we're out here and we're just going to keep looking until we find him. Gracias a todos. The search continues tomorrow morning. California State Parks will bring in a personal watercraft to search the areas that are too shallow for the boats. Live in Santa Barbara, Victoria Sanchez, News Channel 3.